Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm really excited because I purchased this little cutie on Amazon here. Literally still has the plastic on it because I got it today. The reason I got this is because I went on Pinterest and I really loved this bag. I'm gonna try to find it for you right now. This right here is the bag I saw on Pinterest and that is what I'm gonna be recreating today. I thought this was the cutest little thing. If you follow me on Pinterest, I'm always on there looking at stuff. I love Pinterest. So we're gonna go ahead and make this into, oops, this. I'm so excited. It's gonna look so good. $17, I am absolutely obsessed. I love this size, I think it's cute. I don't really like big bulky things to carry around like ever. I don't even like carrying a purse. So this is the perfect size and I love clear bags. So you need one of those. Now, if you don't wanna go ahead and make this, you don't have to, but this is just for entertainment, guys. So I just wanted to show you how to create a beautiful bag from this blank canvas and how easy it is with this machine. So if you're into DIYs or crafting and things like that and you haven't heard of the Cricut, this is a really good product and I'm gonna tell you why. So you can literally make so many things with this. It is, first of all, pink, so you know, your girl loves pink. You can laser cut anything. It has pens, so it will literally draw on cards for you so you can make any type of paper products like it'll literally write stuff out for you instead of printing it so it looks a little bit better a little bit more professional and it laser cuts for like shirts for all different types of products like people make cups and mugs and tumblers and all that kind of stuff but yeah today we are going to work on a handbag so I am so excited about this and let me tell you I have had this gold foil for a while and I decided to use it today. It is an iron-on, so it's supposed to be for clothing and things like that. But we're gonna go ahead and use it on this. And hopefully it turns out because I didn't have regular vinyl. So for clothes, you have iron-on vinyl. And then for products like this, you would have a just stick-on vinyl. And I have different colors, but I didn't have gold. And I really wanted this to be gold. So. We're gonna go ahead and try this out, maybe apply a little heat to it without melting the plastic and see if this works out. So yeah, with the Cricut, you can literally hook it up to your phone. What did they do with my phone? We're gonna open it up. Look how cool this is, like, you know, like the, the music is coming out now, like something's gonna come out of here. It has compartments, so I do have my pen stored in here. So you would literally like put the pen in here and then it'll draw for you. So yeah, that's a really cool feature about it. I'm just going to put this here, frame in it, so I can show you what we're going to do. It's going to be like literally so easy. I can't tell you how easy this is. So there is an app for the Cricut machine and all I did was I literally searched on Google so I went on Google and I typed in LV print PNG. So all these things come up of the LV print here. And I just picked one that looked good and then I saved it to my phone. And then I went into the Cricut app. So you go into the Cricut design app and you can actually upload the image, which I did this a while ago because I wanted to do something with this print. And when I saw this bag, I was like, hey, I'm already ready for this, so. Okay, so this is in the Cricut app right now. And the nice thing is you can remove the background. So I'm just gonna make this really big and then I'm gonna press remove here at the bottom and then you just click on the white and it removes your background for you. Now I'm not gonna use this entire thing so I'm not gonna go in and like erase all of these but how the picture was she had four LVs in the center so I think I'm gonna go with this area right here and I'm gonna have to go in and do that to all the white pieces. I really hope this works out. I love this thing because you can either do this on your phone or on the computer, so it makes it really easy and you connect this thing through uh, Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. Maybe it's Bluetooth, maybe you connect through Bluetooth. Now I went ahead and put it into the little mat and I do have a physical mat, so this just kind of shows you where it's gonna lay on that mat. And right now it's six and a half by 11, which I'm gonna see what the size of my bag is. I'm gonna go ahead and measure my purse right now. And it is seven by seven by four and a quarter. So I'm gonna go back into my app 
and then I'm just gonna adjust that really quickly. I'm just gonna resize it so it's seven by four and a quarter. That is crazy that this is exactly on point. Really, and I put, oh God, I'm a mess today. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is, since I'm doing seven by four anyway, you really don't wanna waste this because this is like expensive stuff. So, we're not gonna waste it. We are going to cut like this. Maybe just like a little bigger, but not very much. And then just kinda cut it. This comes with a cover because this is sticky here. So you just put the cover to the side. You put this this side down. So shiny side goes down on an iron on. For a regular, you would put the shiny side up. So we are just gonna add that to here. Perfect. We're gonna open our Cricut up. Watch how easy this is. Like, I'm not even kidding you. This is so amazing, the way it does this. You put it in here and then push it in. And then I'm gonna go back to my phone and I'm just gonna select cut and it's literally gonna do all the work for me. So are we ready for this? How cool is this? Oh, stop. Stop. I didn't cut it big enough. Now I'm mad because it cut into my map. Like I said, guys, make sure you have enough on there. So now we're gonna peel this off because this sucks. Second time's a charm. Here we go. Can you see that? Wait, let's turn the flash on. Do you see what it's doing? This thing is so cool, huh? It literally is cutting so well. I don't know if you could see this, but this is what it looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and peel off like the rest of it so you can see what we're actually gonna put on the back. I really wanted you to see what I'm doing here. I'm literally just peeling this all off and it's coming off, it's really hard to show you with one hand. All right, so I went ahead and cut out all the pieces. This is what I have left, and then I'm gonna go ahead and peel this off. So here is what it looks like all cut out. Now all I'm literally gonna do is stick it onto this purse. I've gone ahead and put the sticker on there so hopefully it'll stick once I apply heat to it because I really love how this turned out. Let's put you to the side, Cricut. You're done for today. This turned out pretty nice. Now, I kinda had a little bit of trouble, so it was kinda hard to gauge like when it was ready because these pieces started lifting. So then I started going over it, and as, if, as you can see, I don't know if you can tell, but it kinda like bubbled up a little bit on this side. This side looks perfect. This side is a little bit bubbly. And also I had to be careful to try not to melt the plastic. So this was a really difficult thing to do. So I definitely recommend if you're gonna do this, just use regular vinyl, do not use the iron on. But still, I think this is so freaking cute. And once I add the chains, like this is gonna be incredible. I can't believe how cute this turned out. Like it really is. Except for this minor detail here, like, mm, look at how pretty this chain is. Even if you just want the clear purse, I will link this down below. This was so much fun. Now you can literally see how good this Cricut machine is because you can go crazy with your designs. Like you can do designer, you can do your name, you could do anything. Like picture just this bag even like with your name on it. Like I think that would be so cute or like a phrase that you like. If you want me to DIY a bag, I won't do like designer prints, of course, for obvious reasons. But if you want me to DIY a bag like this for you, if you have a certain name that you want on there or you want a custom one, I 
love to make it. So I really hope that you love this. Do not try this at home with iron on. Do not iron on plastic. Plastic does melt. I just wanted to do it because all I had was the iron on and I really wanted to make this video. But for my next bag, I definitely will do it with just the regular vinyl. This is probably my favorite DIY that I have done ever. If you like this video, go ahead and comment down below. Let me know what other videos you'd like to see. I love fashion. I love DIYs. I am like reviving myself through this quarantine. Like all the things that I didn't get to do before quarantine, I am making time for now. So this is so exciting. And I, I like want to DIY more stuff. Like I want to use this Cricut and I'm thinking of like, what else can I make? This Cricut can be used literally for any project, like I said, and there's a ton of tutorials online that will teach you how to use it and what to do and all the different kinds of stuff to make. So if you're into crafting, like I said, I will link that down below. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Like, I'm so excited to make more, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.